Hello, person. I'm here to inspire you, to entertain you a little bit with the wonderful world of game development. This is a pretty awesome model for the creep sneaker. There's the creep knight and there is also a creep knight. These enemies now have a unique behavior. Instead of just running at you, they throw up their shield. Whenever you get close, they do this sliding attack. Your sword goes flying into the air and you have to go pick it up. Look at that, look how, f and there's the archer up here in the top right. Look how, look how unnerving he is when he walks. Oh, there's one of my favorite enemies, the jumper. This little jumping spider guy, he is really funny because he just comes out of nowhere. It's hard to catch him. Hey, keep coming back here. So I want to see which looks better, this darker version or this lighter version. He's using the darker version and when he's running around he's using the lighter version. I'm just going to make his head look really good and then copy his head over. That looks pretty good. I like his horns like that. This is kind of a weird looking face, but that's kind of the point. Yeah, we're putting in this new head. It's got a dual flush system. Dude, everybody needs to save water these days. Use a dual flush head. That's looking freaky and awesome. What is this purple voxel doing here? That's less work. I love it. Blasphemy. Feeling good. Looking fantastic. Bleep Deep up. Whoa, what's this? Look at this random voxel right there. Yeah, he's he's still really creepy. I need to write a tool for palette swapping. I do this so often. I think that's X45. Nope, not X45. Fix it up just a little just, just a little bit. Uh, uh, just fix it up just a just a tiny bit more. But, but I'm leaving it. Leave it real I can't help myself. Not doing there we go. Okay, this got a no. <laughs> Few more. Just a smidgen better. What am I doing? This is one frame of this animation. That's such a really nice. Look at that. Look at that. That's really nice. This is really, really gnar grungy, huh? Super distorted and horrible. Just the way I like it. Look how elongated and weird he looks. Maybe unbreak them. Leave them broken. I know it's kind of weird, but it's kind of cool. Whatever. I'm keeping it. Let's go fight one of these guys. We'll slow down some time and see how he looks in slow-mo dying. I love the creepiness. This is creep factor. Creep factor up to 11. Bam! Oh yeah, he looks actually pretty cool. I love the way he walks. Boom! Yeah! I love him. Let's check this guy in. One thing done. Creep sneaker. Done. Boom! This guy's great. Look how great this guy is. He's got a unique shape. He's, he's sort of like medium sized, got a big belly. Let's live on the wild side and make this guy a huge one. It's totally different. Look at him now. Here's the one, look at him behind his shield. It really helped to exaggerate his shield though. Before I made him have sort of a little round shield and it was like, what's what's that? I don't, know. I don't even know what that is. But when you make it twice as big as it needs to be, then then it's definitely something. And then you look at it and you go, look at this something. Look at this something here. I'm, I, got, I, gotta, I gotta take note of this something. I'm gonna parse out what this something is and store it in my database. He doesn't look very much like a knight though. It'd be nice if he had a helmet and maybe give him a sword. Those things I think will make him more awesome. Adding a couple, like just a few voxels here and there will help. Look at this, this screams circle now. Before it was... It was about, it was a semicircle. This is a real circle right here. Not just any old circle. This is a, an above average circle. Do your shield thing. I think it worked. As much as I want to put a shield somewhere on him all, at all times, we'll make it this called shield and shielded. Animate next, shielded, animate next idle. Look at this voxel right here, it's so leaving it. That's about the, yeah. Uh-huh, yeah, oh, oh, there we go. This is even weirder than I was before. Uh -huh. I can't resist, dude. Just making it a little bit different. Uh, okay, there. Look at look. It's got a little notch now. That's kind of cool. Kind of want to do the notch on all of these. Look how notchy that is. Are you kidding me? Yeah, there it goes. It kind of grows into place. He at least needs a helmet and a sword. Blah, 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 blah. Cool. I like it. Yeah. Duh. That makes it really clear where he's attacking too. I want to put his sword a little closer. Okay, next thing. Sort of a helmety color, and then we'll add some material to it. Maybe we can leave his eyes showing through. This is kind of funny looking, I like it. I kind of like this. Uh, flip on the X-Axe. Awesome. Look at that, he looks armored and ready to go. That's, that, that simply won't do. Okay. He looks better already. Where's he going? <laughs> it's like, I'm bailing. See ya. We can just keep copying and pasting. Uh, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Hey, uh, I love the ones I don't have to worry about the best. Put this down here. Looking good. Yeah, look at him. He's looking good. Yes, I love this. I love his helmet. Okay, and then this one is just 
rotate that back. Oops. Slow down time a bit. We'll get this in slow motion. He's just hiding. Woo! Oh, is it melee attack? We he's got this shield. Now he's got this sort of like this armor on his head and his sword. The way he attacks, the way the way he does that whole shielded movement. I love this guy. Check him in! I can't I can't resist though, just a little bit of this. Clean up the voxels just a little bit because, just because, cleaning up voxels is what I do. This is so messy. Oh my god. This is what happens when you try and rotate things at weird angles. Is it looking better? No, it's not looking any better. Uh, it's looking a little better. Okay, it's looking a little better. Lean it up. Clean it up. Another one down. Cross it off the list. Yes. Is this what the mine looks like right now? It's super tiny. Oh, he just explodes. Okay, we gotta go in the right folder first. Duplicate all. There we go. So easy. This is more of a metallic gray. Do a voxel size of, say, maybe 12, something like that. Attach. Nice. That looks way more like a mine than it used to. I wonder why he's blinking and it's white though. It should be red. Okay, if I get close, he's just like, ah, boom. We added some shadows. Let's see what that looks like with the knight having a shadow. Yeah, I like it. That's pretty good. Very good. Good. Very good. Good. Very good. I love it. I love these enemies having shadows. This is not hard at all. 12. All of these should be red? Red's on the right. Duh. Red is for right. Demonic. It works for me. Keeping it. Move this over. 11. 11. 10. 9. This one's 10. This one's back to 11. Best number ever. Yeah, looking good. Slow motion. Here we go. Getting close. All right, he's got a warning and then boom, he explodes. That works. The knight killed himself. Lead it up first, man. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See if it works. Eh, didn't work at all. Doesn't like that. Not one bit, no. Not one bit, no, Nary. Henry up in a tree. No, Nary. Come down from there, Harry. We're committing all these models. Create unique art for the creep man. We can also commit the data creep stars. We did adding in shadows. The shielded animation for the creep knight. That makes him look freaky while he's walking. He's like, Duh. super jittery. Freaky. Let's play a little bit before we, before we say goodbye. Huh? Or is a great one. Wait, write partial file, what? Definitely don't write a partial file. Oh, there's the jumper. Oh, you know what would really help is that grenade. Yes, give me the grenade. These guys are rocking me. These hairier guys are crazy. I just threw the grenade off. I threw it off the ledge. Oh, I finally got him. Taken down by the baller enemy. The enemies have unique looks, unique attack patterns, which is making the combat more interesting. Thanks for watching this person.